I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. Kenny! He understands. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Go on and talk to him. I got clam if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Okay. What is it with you guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. But don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches, too. They're not all like that. There are good men, too. My friend Lee. He was a good man. Well, I wish I'd had a chance to meet him. Me, too. I wish he was here now. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. How are you feeling? If I'm being honest, I've been better. How did we get here? We walked. At least most of us did. You basically had to be carried. Sitting in the snow. Lean up against a tree. Bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead. For no good reason. And I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin and Becca. Carlos, Sarah. And for what? You don't make any sense. You can't blame yourself. It wasn't your fault. No. Not completely. I could have done more. And that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones. And I gotta live with it. All right. This should work. That's perfect. What'd I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining, mostly. Yeah, nothing important. Okay. You don't gotta tell me if you don't want to. I'm fine. Hey, Clem. Go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. <sighs> okay. That a girl. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. Go on. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. It seems fitting. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. What do you, uh, got there? Because I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier. I'm changing your bandage. Sounds like I don't have much choice in the matter. You don't. You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. Let's get it over with. 
Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. It's okay. I trust you. So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals? I'm... I'm so sorry, Kenny. That bad, huh? You ain't got nothing to apologize for, Clementine. This... wasn't your doing. So, I'm guessing this is going to be the shitty part. <sighs> Don't be a baby. We already got one. <laughs> yeah, we do. <sighs> Holy fucking hell! <sighs> you need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. Ah. Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. But man, does that smart. He can hear a few bad words. I've heard plenty. Yeah, that shouldn't have been the case. I should have gave myself up. Alvin didn't have to die like that. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin should be here, raising this boy. It should be him, not me. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Let's head out. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? it? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! He doesn't speak much English. Arvo, is this where the supplies are? Where the food is? Answer her, goddammit! No, it's at the house. There's still more walk. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen! This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. Stop fighting. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Where everyone isn't at each other's throats? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Shh. 
It's okay. It's okay. You're a natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got them. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. <laughs> 